morning today thanksgiving day workout i want to give you a great quick workout that's not going to wreck you for the rest of the day it's not going to make you super hungry body weight only so everybody can do it you need water and a mat for later on it's going to be a combination of strength and some hit intervals okay I'll move my mat to the side we're doing old school warm-up march it out right here literally the one i did when i auditioned to be a group exercise instructor 25 years ago. Oh my gosh, it's true. I can still remember it. Great big deep breath in right here. Because there's only four moves, that's why I can remember it. Two more like that. Then we're gonna walk front for four and bring it back. One more time right here. Okay, we walk forward for four. So it's one, two, three, heel. One, two, three. I know. We gotta start easy though, although I think it's not hard. Okay, one more right here. Guess what then? Squat right and left right here. So half squat, just get warmed up. Half squat, half squat. Then we'll put those two moves together. One more each way. We'll do two of each. Walk forward to two right here. A little heel tap, you can even clap. I know clap needs to be super big. Squat right and left right here four times. That's it. Last two. Here's two. Don't wait, stay here and jack. No, I have options for you. This is one jack. This is two jack. This is three. Whatever you want to do is fine. Now, I'm going to add that actually in to the top of the walk. Walk up right here. Two jacks. Walk back. Two jacks right here. Squat right and left. One more right here. Okay. Walk it up, let's go. Two jacks. Walk it back. Two jacks right here. Squat right and left. Tap back right and left. That's it. Walk it up right here. So it's one, two, three, two jacks. Walk back. Two jacks. Squat right and left. Tap back right and left. Four, three. Two, walk it up right here. One of each. Jack. Walk it back. Squat right and left. That's it. Tack back right here. There's four. Three. Two. Do it again. One, two, three, two jacks. Walk it back. Squat right and left. Excellent. Now back right here. Four. Three. Two. Now, get those hands on your quads, arch up back. So stretch it out right here. Just a quick warm up, how are you going? Most women I know are up early doing a lot of things Thanksgiving morning. Look over your shoulder right here. I'm thinking, you're not rolling out of bed and doing this. One more thing this way. Down a little bit for you. Roll it up, oh, you want it feels so good. One more right here. Roll it up. Okay, friends. We're gonna get the mat after we do a little tiny warm up set. Tap back right right here. So we're going to turn this into a lunge. Depending on where you are fitness wise, you might stay here. We can get lower. Two more. That's when the mat comes in. Switch. Now that standing leg stays bent, okay? You never want to straighten that out. Hips, knees, everything faces the front. Four more like that. We're gonna slow it down and get a little bit lower before we head to the mat into, okay, slow right here. A little lower and a little slower. One more right here. Switch. Excellent work. Now, if you can't go lower, stay with whatever works for you. One more right here. Now grab that mat or towel, it's fine. Now, if you are unable to go to the ground, I just want you to go down for two, up for two, to your range of motion. Here we go. Down, touch, up. Oh, that's a huge range of motion. Everything faces the front, okay? Down, pressing up to that heel that's on the ground. 500 more, no. Nice work, nice work. Just two more here. 
it seems like a lot because we're going slowly. One more here. Come on up. Let's switch sides to that mat so your knee has a nice place to be. Down for two right here. Ah. Or you're here. Okay, totally up to you. What is available for you today? This is your workout, your day. Do what feels best for your body. Except for turning me off. Don't turn me off. Ah, balance challenge as well. Two more like that. There's two. One more right here. Come on up, shake it out. I talked about a little bit of hit. We're gonna do, you can do a squat thrust or a burpee. What's the difference? Or you can dance. You can sit here and dance. Or better than me, hopefully. Squat thrust. It's all kind of way up. Hands down, walk to a plank. Please don't come like this. Up, stand up. We're not doing a burpee all the way down to the ground. If you cannot do that move, here's what you can do. You can squat, keeping that chest up. We might do those later. Okay, we're gonna do four sets, 15 seconds, let's go. Come up and hop at the top. You can step back, all sorts of modifications. Rest. We got one strength, one hit, one strength, one hit. Drink water whenever you need to. Please don't wait for me to tell you. Five more seconds of rest. And we're starting set number two, so I don't forget. You know what we're doing. Here we go. Remember, keep those hips high. Don't let them drop. Rest. Oh, halfway done. High five. Getting a lot of good work done this morning or afternoon. It's afternoon right now, so I can't face the other way. Okay, two to go. Here we go. Yeah. I'm sure you can hear me moaning and moaning. That's not a bad thing. Rest. One more to go. Those are not as terrible as one burpees, but they do get your heart rate up, which is what I want to do. We're going to feel great after we're done and enjoy your family the rest of the day. Okay, we are on our last set. Let's go. Finish strong. Come on. Done. Okay, can move that mat out of the way for now. Get a drink if you need to. We need some balance. Core and balance. Take a medium step back. Your arms are gonna be up here. We're gonna do a stand-up crunch. We're gonna here, so you're gonna contract and balance at the same time. It's okay to tap down. Whew, excuse me. Only 400. Here we go. Contract. Tap. Now, if your balance is great, try not to tap down. Breathe out. Contract those abs. Two more. Two. Ooh, hold it here. Hold it here. Your standing leg is bent. It's okay if you fall over. Four, three, two, and one. Oh, shake it out. Okay. Remember, this leg stays bent or else you're going to feel it in your back. Arms up. Here we go. Tap down if you need to, or challenge yourself and don't. Four more like that. Four, three, two, hold it here, but not your breath. Come on. Four, three, two, and one. Now you should be, we've all done a million crunches. When you crunch up, you're contracting right here. That's the same thing you're doing with a much bigger range of motion. Ready, here we go, faster. Old school, if you did aerobics, knee repeater. But we're gonna slow it down, ready? Slow it down right here. Tap. We started old school with my warm up. I had to throw a little bit more old school in there. Last two right here. Left leg is bent. We're standing leg is bent. Four, three, two, and one. Last one. Starting with that repeater. Arms up. Bend that standing leg. Here we go. That's it. 
Okay, slow it down right here. Snap down or not. This is your day. Come on. We're gonna feel so accomplished by the end. Last two right here. Here's two. Hold it here, hold it here. Oh, hold it here. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, now for our hits. We're gonna get down on the ground and get back up because it's one of my favorite ones. And I think everybody needs to be able to do it. You might need a whole mat. I'm just gonna do a half mat. So for those of you that have not done this before, you're gonna sit down, you're gonna roll back, you're gonna come up and use your hands and cross your legs and stand up. You've done it before and you're getting good at it because you know it's coming up. And stand up. Oh, I love it so much. If you just need to practice rolling up off the mat, that's totally fine. 15 seconds on, 15 seconds off. Only four times, but it definitely gets your heart rate up. And I want you to always be able to get up off the ground. Here we go. Breathe. Talk about a full body exercise. One more. Whew. That mat makes it worse. Are you breathing hard? You're breathing as hard as I am. It's a great exercise to try a couple times a week just to get up off the ground. Ready? Here we go. You can cross your arms. I'm sorry. Leg. That's easier to get up. Use your hands. One more, come on. I know I make it look easy, but I've been doing this in my class for 15 years when I used to teach inside classrooms. It is such a great skill. Once you master it, and you can. Two more rounds, here we go. Talk about it. Fantastic exercise. You feel how tight your core is when you stand up. Oh, one more. Oh, that's three. Darn it, only one more to go. I love that one so much. Okay, and if you're saying damn Pam, I totally accept that as a compliment, just so you know. Last one, here we go. Oh, we'll get water after this. Come on, one more. Ugh. Super duper high five. Grab a drink of water. Actually, your water bottle, I want to put it on the ground. We need some more balance. If that is too low, if you come and touch your knee, we're gonna be doing this. But if that's too low, come on down, touch your knee. Most importantly, head, neck, spine, straight line. Ready, here we go. So you're not hunching your shoulders forward. Your body looks like a teeter-totter. Two more, then we're gonna hold it. Hello, hamstring. And falling over is normal. Stay right here, stay here, four, three, two, fall over. Strength can happen just with body weight. Did you feel that right there? I hope so, okay. Other hand behind your back. Here we go. Slow and controlled, please don't rush this. Try to stay with me as infuriating slow as it might be. And breathe, your breathing helps. More balance for sure. Last two before I hold it. Here's two. Last one. Hold it here, not your breath though. Four, three, two, and one. One more time each way. Arm out, I'll count us. Down for two right here. Down for two, up, up, down, down. Excellent. 
down, down, up, up. Two more like that. Down for two. One more here. Hold it here. Find that focus. Keep breathing. Three, two, and one. Last one. Right hand behind that back. Left hand. Roll the shoulders back and away from your ears. Ready? Here we go. Oh. And breathe. Moan, groan, breathe. No cursed lips, please. You regulars, you know I say that all the time. It's a natural reaction. When your body is working hard. One more here. We're holding. We're holding. Four, three, two, and one. Oh my gosh. Okay. We're going to keep that right there. If you are unable to jump, if you have bad knees, bad back, or you're downright poop, you're going to squat. So your options are this. You can even touch and touch. So option one, squatting. Option two, called the drop squat. Or option three, you can dance. I can't see what you're doing. I just want you to move. 15 seconds on. Last four, then we're gonna get some upper bodies and core in. Remember, do what's best for you. Here we go. Come on, stay with me. Nice light landing, please. Done. Good thing I have all my sweat rag. <laughs> Are you starting to sweat? I'm sorry. Are you starting to have some liquid awesome come off your body? A little or a lot? Okay. One down, three to go. Or you're here. Let's go. I want you, no matter what, your chest up, not facing the ground, please. Okay, always when you're squatting. One more. Rest. I don't know what happened to the music. Let me get the music. Oh, there it is. Whew. Okay. Two down, two to go. Then we'll do some fun plank stuff. 50 more seconds, ready, set, go. Chest up, chest up, come on. You don't have to touch down actually all the way. Okay, pull it up to you. Lift up, no matter what. Almost there. Rest. How are those legs feeling? We'll get water after this and then get our heart rate down before we get down on the ground. Last one. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Last one, here we go. Make it your best one. You are strong, you are powerful. You can finish this no matter what. Done. <gasps> Quick drink. Okay. I cannot get you on the ground. Put your heart rate up like mine is. Let's do some obliques. Go post arms, bend your knees, side to side. Side. Your head follows your body. Does not say looking at me. Now you're holding that core nice and tight. So your heart rate coming down. Breathing is more normal. You never, when you're on your own, want to get on the ground. If your heart rate is high, you might get a little lightheaded. I do not want that. I want you to feel strong and amazing the whole time. Nice work. Let's do eight more before you come to the plank. Eight, make them your best. One more, just like that. Come on. Four. Three. There's two. Okay, you are doing such an amazing job. Plank, where do your shoulder tap? You can give yourself a pat on the back because you're doing such a great job. Now, if full body does not work for you, you can absolutely be on your knees. Your, op your options are gonna be on your knees or full body. Or you can hold the plank without touching your shoulders at all. It's totally up to you. I just want you to do something. We're gonna go for 30 seconds of fun. 
hands right under your shoulders or elbows. Here we go. And breathe, and breathe. Lift those hips a little bit. Long time left to go. Stay strong in your mind. Come on. Yes, last 10 seconds. You can do this. Stay with me. Done. We're gonna do one more. That's it. Then we stretch. Okay, so I want this workout to fit into your day, not to kill you, not to make you crazy starving, but to work head to toe and feel amazing. Well, any more than push-ups, I'll wait on those for the next workout. Plank is still upper body, shoulders, a little bit tricep, and core. Last one for 30 seconds. Positive mindset, please. Yes, you can. Get set up. Here we go. You can tap. You can hold it. Head, neck, spine, straight line. Lift those hips up just a touch. And breathe. Tighten up your glutes. Tighten up your quads. Come on. We have 10 more seconds. You can do anything for 10 seconds. Last five right here. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, I don't mean to be a liar, liar, pants on fire, but I feel like we should do push ups. Okay, I want them to be tricep push ups. On your knees. Here's what we're gonna do, friends. Your hands are gonna be like this. You're gonna go down a couple inches or just five or six inches. That's it. And come on up. Okay, we're gonna start with five. Hands in that diamond shape. Ready, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. One thing I wanna mention, it's easy for your head to drop. Your head is not involved in this at all, okay? Just your arms. Two more sets of five and then we'll stretch. You might be saying damn ham, but you'll be happy at the very end. So only five. Get those hands set back up. Do not move your head. Look about a foot in front of your hands. Five. Four. Come on. Breathe out. Three. Two. One. If you go down an inch, that is enough. If you get on two inches, that is enough. This is your work at everybody's at a different place. Do what you can. One more set. Then it's all about the stretch. Only five. Okay, come on back. Take a deep breath in and blow it out. Last five, here we go. Five, keep that head steady. Four, three, two, one. Lean back, stretch it out. Let me get some stretchy music on. Okay. I hope you feel really, really good about that. That was 23 minutes of awesomeness. Now, let's have a seat. You guys with me? Okay, you can sit. Okay. Legs out straight. Walk your hands down your legs until you feel a hamstring stretch. It might be here. It might be here. Actually, it's from this side. It might be here. Wherever it is best for you. I want you to stay there and breathe. I want you to down towards your knees. And you know me, you know I always help her through the stretch because you just work so hard for me. And your muscles need the, uh, the rest, really, the rest, and so you won't be tight for the rest of the day. Let's put your right leg over your left, left hand behind that right knee, and I want you to look all the way behind you. For a seated spinal twist, feels so good. And you can come back to stretching anytime, either on any one of my videos or my stretching playlist. Switch. I have 28 videos, so left foot over your right leg, right arm here, come down. 28 videos for you to stretch to. Your left side, of course, is going to be quite as the other leg. Them, the balance one. 
of your foot like this. And I want you to put this knee towards the ground and bring your other foot in towards your butt. Oh, you should feel that right in your right glute. And if you think that I'm a pain in your ass right now, you would be right in the best way possible. This is a seated pigeon if you're familiar with yoga, but I really don't want to get all the way on the ground and do that. So this is another way to stretch your glute. breathe. And let's switch. Again, you're dropping that knee towards the ground and bringing that foot back. Oh, yep, yeah, till you get to that spot where your face goes like this. I just had a conversation with a woman today who was having trouble finding time to fit in exercise in her life. You don't need an hour. Today with a stretch is going to be a bit over 25 minutes. That's enough. Anybody can fit 25 minutes into their day. You work from home, you can break it up into 12 minutes and 13 minutes or do it all at once. But fitting a little bit in is better than fitting none into your day to come out of that. So that's why my 10 minute playlist is so long because 10 minutes of nonstop work is great. Just bring your, sh your shoulder, <laughs> bring your head over to the right and feel that beautiful stretch. In your left neck. Now put those left fingertips on the ground. If you've done this with me before, you know how great this feels. I always want a little bit of exercise to be available to you any day of the week. You absolutely do not need an hour. Let's bring that hand back to your knee, chin to your chest, and switch sides. Put those right fingertips on the ground. We all feel better when we move our bodies. I know in the days when we can't, it inspires guilt and then just, you know, bad feelings the rest of the day. Getting a little bit in to start your day is a great, great way to start the day. Let's bring your chin to your chest. To bring your hands behind you, press your shoulders down and away as your hands are clasped. And I let that go. Let's bring it out to the front, round your shoulders and your back. It up, come all the way up and out. Hey, thank you so much for your time today. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day with your family. And remember, every minute you spend on yourself and your health is absolutely worth it. Now go have a great day.